this is wild. So it says the half goes to the state school system. So I guess when they do the taxes or whatever, for like me, I live in Maryland, right? So it says half goes to your state school system, and then it's taxed 24% on top, and then 17% is for federal and state taxes. So comparing to another comment, and I, I don't think you can comment for both comments or whatever on here, but one person said it's a total of 51% that you end up taking home if you take the lump sum. And when you get the annuity, you're taxed every year. So that's what I was told m from multiple people. I can't verify it, and I am going to do the research because I think like it's important to not give misinformation, right? But this comment was wild because I've looked high and low to see like if like lottery winnings actually goes to the state school system because where I live, I don't think there has been a recent like Mega Millions or Powerball winner. So I can't go and verify that. But I guess more recent winners, like you would say, like North Carolina, the woman who I talked about in the previous video, like did a portion of her earnings or her winnings go towards the state school system? That's important. California, they've had the most from what I've researched, lotto winners, right? So their school systems like is that money going towards them Th this is important information for me because as somebody who has family members who play the mega millions the power balls and stuff like that just the lottery in general scratch offs and everything i'm like yo like if they win and they take that lump sum of money right like is it going towards their school system secondly because again this is a completely different like subject what if you buy a ticket? Say if you go out of town, right? You're out of town. You're in Florida, right? You get your ticket from Florida, which again, state itself, no taxes, right? You buy a winning ticket in Florida, but you live in the you know in Washington D.C. Does that mean that you won't be taxed because you bought the ticket there, even though you live in a different residence, or do you have to do some type of like thing? in order to make it work so it's like hey that winning ticket even though it was purchased in florida you live in a certain place let me know